Hello guys and welcome back to the How To Animate YouTube channel and in today's video we're going to be continuing on with this lip sync this can be part six of this series and I've now upgraded to Maya 2019 and I've got to tell you guys this is awesome uh, if you watched the last video you know I was struggling with uh, frame rate playback on this rig and now if you watch getting a steady 30 frames per second so it's well worth downloading my 2019 I've done a great job of uh, sorting out this frame rate problem with heavy rigs um, you'll know that cached playback is on if you've got this green button here selected and if you'd like to increase memory so simply go into your preferences go to cached playback and you just increase the amount of RAM up to whatever you like so guys in this video we are going to be taking the rest of this animation up to first pass so as you can see I've done first pass on the body here so we're going to be continuing on with the lip sync all the way to the end and in the next video we're going to be doing polish on this entire thing and taking it through to a final state obviously this animation was a lot longer but this series could go on for a long time the, the total clip is about 30 seconds with two characters so what I'll be doing is, is working on that on my own time I might record it and do like a time-lapse thing and just comment here and there but for the most part two more videos on this series and then we're on to horses which I'm really excited about to be doing some creature animation with you guys so let's get started so we are going to animate the jawbone first get the main open and shuts done first so here we go we're going to be doing this section here I start to get a little something I start to get a little something okay so I'm going to keep it kind of closed during this section I so I open for the eye okay so we've got an S shape here so slightly open for the S shape start so quite wide for art start Okay, we've got another little t, which is would be a two. But you don't want to actually do the two because it's not pronounced enough, so it's a t. I start to get a little Okay, so for together, if you was to do that, you're going to have the jaw going like this too much so the main beat there would be ah as long as you hit that ah it should be fine okay so this will be a held l shape here going into little L so it's held quite a long time there so it's going to give it a little wiggle here just to hold that okay and for the little this is where it opens again might just want to anticipate that bit so i'm just going to bring this a bit closed here shape here going into something so slightly open for that and that's held for quite a while as well okay something so ah uh, something some okay close for the M some and then thing okay and that should be it I start to get a little something I start to get a little something okay so again it's important not to do too much just find those main beats and that is that section complete so now that the jawbone is animated what i like to do now is do the main oohs and ease so i'm just going to select these two controls here which basically control the ins and the outs and you'll see here because this is a new Maya, this is all set up wrong um i'd like to be able to move these together so i'm just going to set this instead of world to object which then allows me to which allows me to move them together like this now okay 
Okay, so now I've gone ahead and put all the oohs and the e's in. It looks like this. I start to get a little something. I start to get a little something. So next we're going to work our way up the face. So we're going to do the main sheet controls here. And now I'm going to work on this center controller here, which basically kind of offsets the mouth. Okay, now I'm going to do a pass on the eyes, add some blinks in, and just generally shape the eyes. Okay, so with the eye and the eyebrow pass, it now looks like this. I start to get a little something. I start to get a little something. So the last thing I'd like to do on this is just add some tongue animation. There's a lot of L's in here that are kind of missing. So it's going to do a pass on the tongue now. Okay, guys, so that is now first pass complete. I'm just going to play this for you. Now I start to get a little ahead. I start to get a little something for myself, and this happens. Okay, so I'm quite happy with that as a first pass. There's still a lot of polishing to do. Um, so in the next video, I'm going to go through the body again uh, and show you some stuff in the graph editor, show you how I polish animations there. And obviously, with the face, I've literally just animated all of the main controllers, and there's still tons and tons of smaller controllers to refine the shapes and stuff. So we'll be doing that as well. So, yep, next video is the final video, and we're going to be going through and polishing this to final. So I hope you've enjoyed this series so far, and hope to see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.